Hi and welcome students. In this Microsoft Word 2016 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to manage add-ins and security options. Let's get started. So first thing, let's find out where these two things are located. If I go to the File tab and I go to the Options button down in the bottom left, you will see that it opens up the Word options. And if you go down here to Add-ins, you can see all of the current add-ins that are on your computer. And the Trust Center will also show your security settings on Word. Uh, you could also open up your Trust Center settings to disable all macros with notifications, as well as uh, uh, re-enable them if you want to. Most of these things aren't going to be uh, necessary for creating documents, but I do want to focus on add-ins and um, the special functionality that they provide for certain things. So what an add-in is, is it's like I said a special utility. It's usually created by a third party and it's created to do something that is a very specific purpose. And so you could actually find a list of add-ins or a list of available add-ins available on um, Word and all you have to do is go to the insert tab add-ins group right here and you can see that you have a store that allows you to purchase uh, or download for free certain add-ins as well as a list of current add-ins that you have on your computer and so you'll see that I've used translator in the past and so it's right here and I also see that I could view all of my available office add-ins so if I click on that it'll say office add-ins and it says right here is translator and if I ever want to learn more about translator I could just click on options and then click on details and it'll bring up a web page and the web page says translate words and sentences that you've used in a document using Microsoft Trainer. I can see that this add-in is from Microsoft Corporation as well as the reviews for this add-in and what its overall score is and what it does in the description area. So if you're interested in seeing available add-ins all you have to do is click on the store which can either be done right here on store or you can click right here on store. When you click store you'll be able to uh, look through all for the category or something more specific depending on what you're trying to do. You could also see suggested for you, the ones with the highest rating, and all of them in alphabetical order. Okay. Whenever you are interested in looking to see what something does, you could actually click right on it and it's going to open it up and it'll give you a little thumbnail and let you know what it does and then in the description here it'll show you exactly what it does as well as the reviews and what other people are saying about it and if it'll work for your version of Microsoft Word. So if you want to end up adding it you just go right here to add and then if you did add it you will then be able to start it up by going right here to add-ins and click the arrow and choosing the add-in. I'll show you translator right here and if I click on translator it'll open up a translation pane on the right side and right now I have English to French set up but let's say I wanted to translate words from English into say Spanish I can click right there and if I type in hello right here I could then see the functionality of the add-in because I type in hello I highlight the word it says hello in English and then it says hola in Spanish and so that's one of the many functionality uh, tools that you could find inside of Microsoft Word that can easily help you translate words or a variety of different other uh, options. And so if this video has been helpful for you, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you have any questions, please put it in the comment section below and I'll do my best to respond to you. Thanks again.